Hello guys, today I will be showing you how to write a Python program in Microsoft Visual Studio. My previous video was made on PyCharm and uh, if you want to view that also, that will be available at the end of this video. The screen element, element will be available. You can uh, click it and you can view it if, you, if it is required. So currently, uh, we will uh, move with uh, Microsoft Visual Studio. So this is the freeware, this is an open source tool, this is the path here, this path will be available in my description box. We have three versions here, this community, professional and enterprise. Community is an open source, you can download this. Just click the button here. And you can, you don't need to fill this. The installer file is downloaded. So uh, let us open it. Run. So so let it let it download. So it is I think uh, downloading the package. Okay, installer continue. So it will download and then install. It will take some time. It's almost uh, 70 MB. So. Let it continue, and uh, so both PyCharm, so PyCharm is also a free one, so it's an open source. We are downloaded, we have downloaded the PyCharm community version, and for Microsoft Visual Studio also it's a community version. So both works fine, so it all depends on the look and the UI. So you can use both if you want, you can check, you can download PyCharm and you can write your code and check how it is for you, and you can download the same for Visual Studio and validate it. So it depends on you which one you like and you can start working with it. But both are awesome. So here it's so we can have any uh, packages you can install. So for me like currently I will go with uh, Python alone. So let us click it. So it will, in will it will install. So I don't want this because I already have a Python 3.7.4 installed in my system. If you don't have, you can uh, check this and you can uh, install it, but uh, I don't want this as of now to install. That's a pretty big file, that is 713 MB. So it's done. So let us see our Visual Studio 2019 is getting popped up. And we'll see our Visual Studio. All right, this. Okay, so here is my Visual Studio. So it asks for like if you want to create an account, you can create it. Or if you already have an account, you can sign in. For me, like I will uh, press not now, maybe later. This is just for the UI, what kind, what kind of theme you want. So, for example, we'll go with the default one, blue. Okay, so here we are. So we'll have this kind of wizard and clone or checkout code, open a project solution if you already have a project. If you want to clone some codes from the previous one, you can do it from here. And if you already have some project, you can open a local folder. But at this moment, we'll go with the create a new project. Okay. So we have, since we have developed the Python, so we have all Python related uh, modules here. So, so here you want to create a project templates, what template you want. So I will be using default Python application. So here is a project name. What kind of project name you want to put? So I, uh, let me put test. And this is the location. Uh, this location is will be here. So you can change your location at any place. So this is my directory. That's fine. Solution name is test. The solution name will be same as project name. 
can change the solution and name as well if you want but uh, for the, at this time we'll be keeping it same and then we'll have a create okay so here we are on your project so let us see let us write a simple program so it, it automatically take our Python 64 bit so whatever I have already installed in my system so it has taken it and if you want to add some more Python environments you can edit the environment like if you have more than uh, two setups of Python like 32 bit or 64 bit you can add one more environment so since I have only one so it shows only one uh, environment only it is that Python 307 64 bit so let us write a simple code this one equal to 30 num2 equal to 40 sum equal to num underscore 1 plus num underscore 2 is correct right yeah print sum let us see what is the output we are getting yep we got the output here 70 this is one simple program okay so let us see like how we can add the Python modules or Python packages uh, from 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 Microsoft Visual Studio only so if you see here Python 3.7 here if you see here we have a solution explorer here and if you don't see this uh, tab here you can go to view and you can click uh, solution explorer so you will get the dialog box here and uh, let us see how we can add a uh, Python modules here right click on this and you can say minus manage Python packages and from here itself you can install a package say like let me install a package called pandas elevate now so let me check with the credential Okay, so we can see a successfully installed NumPy pandas and that so you can see that then successfully installed pandas So now you can see this uh, Python package here in the solution explorer Pandas along with pandas we have NumPy Python data details. So these are the modules installed along with pandas If you want to delete this you can just right click on the modules and you can remove it So hope you have understood how we can integrate Python with uh, Microsoft Visual Studio and how to install and uninstall the Python modules or Python packages. If you have liked my video, please press like button and subscribe my channel for more contents. Thank you for watching.